Welcome to the ITDVDs.com YouTube channel. This is just a sample of the training available at ITDVDs.com. If you would like to see complete training, please go to ITDVDs.com. Now let's begin the sample. The Ethernet protocol functions at layer 2, which is the data link layer. Ethernet uses MAC addresses for addressing, and we've seen MAC addresses before. Here's an example, 00-21-5C-23-67-DB. And these dashes can also be colons, and we'll see another format as well with periods. It's just a different way of writing a MAC address. The MAC address is still the same, and the bottom line is every MAC address has 48 bits total which is 6 bytes, because remember there's 8 bits in a byte, so 6 times 8 is 48, and each one of these sections is a byte. So this is a byte, 0, 0, 21 is a byte, 5C is a byte, and so on and so forth. So there's 6 total. And MAC addresses are in hexadecimal format. We're going to talk about that more in depth in a bit, but real quickly, it's hexadecimal is base 16, where normally we're used to decimal, which is base 10, 0 through 9. Hexadecimal uses 0 through 9, the numbers, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. For the number 10, it actually uses the letter A. And for 11, it uses B, 12, C, 13, D, 14, E, and 15, F. So it goes all the way up to 15, so 0 through 15, with 10 through 15 being letters. And a MAC address is burned onto every Ethernet network card. So all your computers, the network ports on them have their own MAC address. And this goes for routers too. So your routers, all the Ethernet interfaces on your routers have MAC addresses. Let's take a look at that. So I'm consoled into one of my routers, and we'll go over how to do this in a bit. I'm just going to run the show interfaces command. And here's one of my fast Ethernet interfaces on my router. It's actually fast Ethernet 00. And we can see the hardware address is 0001.9654.5F20. So this is its MAC address. And this is just a different way of writing it with periods. But you can see these two digits here are one byte. 01 is another byte, 96 is another byte, 54 is another byte, 5F is another byte, and 20 is another byte. So we have 6 bytes, 48 bits. So this is its MAC address. Let's go take a look at another interface here. Here's Fast Ethernet 01, and this is its MAC address. So you can see it's very similar, but the last bit is actually different, or the last byte is actually different. It's got a 21 at the end, if we scroll back up and take a look at Fast Ethernet 00, we see it was actually 20. And this is common in routers for the interface ports to have very close MAC addresses, but they don't necessarily have to be. And every MAC address is unique because it's actually burned into the network card. So we don't assign it a MAC address. And the way that the vendors that make the networking cards assure that it is unique is one by assi getting assigned an OUI or organizationally unique identifier so each vendor is going to get assigned this unique identifier and this is the first 24 bits of your MAC address so it's 00215C this is going to be the OUI and the IEEE is what actually assigns a vendor that OUI. And IEEE is the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers. So if I want to make networking cards, I need to go to the IEEE and say, hey, you know, I'm going to need an organizationally unique identifier. They assign me one. So all of the network cards that I make are going to start with the same 24 bits. And then I will assign the net, each network card a unique last 24 bits. So that's how we ensure that each MAC address is unique. Now let's take a look at this first bit here, uh, I slash G. It's individual slash group. That's what that stands for. And if it's a zero, then it's going to be a device, an actual Ethernet device. If it's a one, then that means this address, this MAC address is either going to be a 
broadcast or multicast MAC address. And then the second bit here, G slash L, stands for global, local. When it's a zero, it means that this MAC address was assigned by the IEEE, or this first 24 bits, this OUI was assigned by the IEEE. If it was a one, then it means that uh, we basically assigned we basically assigned this MAC address, or we basically assigned this OUI ourselves. We didn't get it from the IEEE. So just to recap, remember a MAC address is 48 bits long. The first 24 bits is the organizationally unique identifier or OUI. The last 24 bits is vendor assigned.